Well, that was fun. He's still smiling. He doesn't care that he's $270,000 behind. It's only money. Action is on Phil Ivy here. The man who is $270,000 behind. He's going to limp in here. He's got the snowman. Cool. Also in his Tony G. And he's got Queen 10 offsuit. Cool. That's going to bring Letter in with a 5 cool. 3 a half. A bit more creative. Alan's in as well. Pocket fours for Alan. No wow, six handed. A few flops here that could get some people involved. Six four juice. How about that flop for Howard Letterer? He has flopped the nuts, and we're going to get a monster here. Alan Cunningham has a set of fours. Howard Letterer has flopped the nuts. And let's not forget, Phil Ivey's got the overpair with the eights. Oh, this is going to be a doozy. Howard trying to work out how to play this hand. Alan's sitting there with a the set thinking he's in great shape. Howard's going to put in a small raise by the looks of things. And I like the raise, because you don't want to let a jack or a queen come off and kill your action from Phil Ivey. Obviously, he doesn't know that Alan Cunningham has a set behind him. And he wouldn't normally think he would bump it up, raise it up with the nuts. It's going to be very hard for Alan to give a 5-3 in a hand by, uh, the hand of uh, Howard Lederer. Now, this was an unraised pot, so anybody could have anything. You never want to go broke in an unraised pot. Cool. And you get a quick call from Alan Cunningham. Andy Block's gone. I want to see how Phil Ivey plays this year. Chris Ferguson, ace eight, offshoot. Not too relevant right now, apart from the eight in his hand, one of Ivy's outs. Not that Ivy actually has a direct out, but it'll be a card that Ivy would be hoping to hit. Ferguson with the pregnant pause. Oh, and we've got a monster here. Look at this, a set of fours for Cunningham. Straight for Letterer. And Ivy with the overpair. And I'm not sure what Ferguson is wasting our time for. Maybe he's trying to think of a, a creative play. I really wish I knew what was going through Chris Ferguson's mind. He puts in 25,000 right now, we're going to know. Does Chris Ferguson know he has cards? No, see, I, I, I don't think Chris Ferguson knew he had cards. There you go. He just stared half the table thinking he's going to be coming for a big bet. And Phil Ivey lays down his hand there. Very good play from Phil. Yeah, great lay down from Phil. And this is heads up here. We've got a set for Alan Cunningham and a straight for Howard Leonard. Part is 25,000. The Queen of Spades changes nothing. He looks the part though. Someone just pulled the moneymaker? How would you act? He has the stone cold nuts right now. What do you make to do that? Huh? The year he won, like earlier. He was just sitting time. there for a while. That's not my first time. <laughs> I guess it's the mark of a champion. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, a couple of hands out there that Alan Cunningham cannot beat. He can't beat a set of sixes and he can't beat the three fives. Everything else, he's got. <laughs> can't imagine how a letter has queens here. <laughs> I'll get the hand played out too far. The pot is 25,400. And the professor trying to figure out what to do. Yeah, hypnotize them and forget that they even have cards. Lobby. Obviously a curious observer. He threw away his eights. I've been watching. Okay. Is Howard playing?
later with his chips. But he's checked, Howard. Looks How like he's checked. Yeah, he's going to set the trap here. It's not a bad play. He gives Alan a set. He did an awful lot of acting there. And then, of course, the check. And Alan Cunningham thinking, what do I do here? I'll tell you, if Alan Cunningham takes the card here, I won't believe that he can't see to the cards. And look at that, he checks. It's like he has a seven cents. Wow. Look at that, and the river pairs the board. It's a deuce on the river. That's going to kill Letterer. Cunningham has the full house hair now. Four is full of deuces. And Letterer's hand is complete rubbish. Unbelievable. Oh, wow. Letter is trying to get tricky on the turn. And he burns himself. Ten thousand is the bet. A small bet. Ten thousand into a twenty-five thousand dollar pot. I don't see how Letter folds this. I, th I think he's going to call, but I don't think he likes it. The only hand he can really give Valen on here is a set at the end of the day.